I'll take it. I'm here. Why not? <laughs> Good morning, friends. Quite early again. But uh, Brandon Dayton is back with some Project Zomboid. I'm a little bit hungry, so I'm gonna go downstairs and see what we got. My character seems to be walking uh, a little bit faster today, maybe. Which is a good indication that we're healing. Can I go through here? Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, but until I get up to like regular walking speed, I'm kind of scared to take the take the splint off. I'll just be safe for now. Uh, avocados are good in the morning. You just put some salt on them things. Oh my goodness. Eat some bananas. Hmm. That's nice. You make a smoothie with some banana and some avocado. Oh. Better than you ever could have thunk it. Um. And I'm gonna throw this out. That's gross. Oh. We're nice and full now. So let's see. What is uh, waiting out in the big wide world? The character is a little bit thirsty, I think. Both of the bottles that I had are completely empty, so uh, I'll need to stop by somewheres. Somewheres. And we can do something about that. I think this is just the, uh, the back of the post office. I'm not expecting to find any water in here. You can, like, uh, lick the back of the postage stamps, maybe? And then you start salivating. <laughs> is that gonna quench your thirst? Are you gonna be okay? No. No. I think not. Doctor's bag. We need to equip secondary. Baseball bat and primary. Just so we can get the uh, maximum amount of loot. Oh yeah. I need to keep myself well fed. But that is a difficult prospect at the moment. Especially when you're running around. Running around in the wilds. Hmm. Hmm. Nine pounds. Do we fit that? Mm, I might need to move some stuff. Just a little bit. Yes. Screwdriver. You can go in this one. So, uh, if you haven't guessed, we're headed back to the same spot today. <laughs> trying to pick up the rest of my logs so I can get this wall nice and finished. I think that's going to be a good thing. I did forget to grab the door frames and shit like that, however. Um, but yeah, I know it's in my house, so it's not going to be too bad. I can swoop those up at any time. Which, uh, yeah, the sooner the better, I suppose. But until the wall's completely done, um, what does it really matter? What does it really matter? Well, we could fit one more log. Oh, yeah. We'll be a little exerted, but uh, that's all right. I went to bed exerted yesterday, and guess what? Guess what happened? Not a fucking thing. Woke up feeling rested as shit. <laughs> it was amazing. It was magical. I should probably uh, put this axe down somewhere. But I don't want to forget about it. My precious axe. The only one that I have at the moment. And, uh, if we lose it, lose the ability to chop trees and shit, uh, it's not gonna be good. I'm gonna be real bad about that. Sprinting is leveling. That is fucking... <laughs> just nuts. I am sprinting around, but, uh, with a sprint. With a splint on my foot. God damn it. I blew the punchline for the joke before I even finished making it. Splint with a sprint. S I did it again. <laughs> I'm trying to say the reverse of that, but apparently I can't. Oh my god, is there somebody in my... In my restaurant? Somebody broke a window in my restaurant. Hello? Fuck. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You think you could just be here? Oh fuck. Now I broke a window. Thanks so much. You ass. You ass of shit! 
So uh, we're going to need to to get some more wood, I suppose, because I am going to have to plank up these windows. Or are they already barricaded? I don't know. I don't understand. Cut up this log. Just one for now, please. Slightly thirsty. A little bit of pain. Oh, boy. The struggle. The endless struggle. Alright, we're gonna need uh, another log. Cut that up. That's good. People like that one. Um, continue barricading, please. And then do we need to do that one? Apparently we do. You guys. Did they peel barricades off all my windows? What the fuck? I don't understand. Open the curtains. Barricade the window. Oh, I'm barricading it from the other side. I see. Well, that's a useful thing, I suppose. But they are barricaded, right? That's that's what I'm That's what I'm wanting to know. <laughs> I don't need any more zombies coming in here. It would be smart to build the wall all the way around, but I consider this like kind of a middle ground. Like it's between my loot room and the kitchen and the upstairs part. There's not really a whole lot of uh important stuff in there. So I think it's a, a good place. A good place to have things. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back out with my with my other shit. I don't want to leave the doctor's bag necessarily, but I will for now. I'll come back for you, I promise. We're gonna need to fill up our uh, our bottles. Fill up both. Why not fill all? There we go. Mm-hmm. Maybe we drink a little bit, too. Drinky drink. All right. It's a good day. We're feeling productive. Everything's going our way. We're almost done with the, uh, the fence here. But there was a little distraction. As there tends to be quite often in Project Zomboid. Oh, look. A fucking thing. Great. Great! Now I've got to deal with this. <laughs> Where's my hammer? Hmm. Equipped in my hand. So let's make a wooden wall. Rotate. There we go. That's looking nice, isn't it? One, two, three, four, maybe five, roughly. Ah, uh, it's all right. Everything's gonna be just fine. Oh, I did put my fucking doctor bag down. Which was maybe not smart. Because uh, I was shoving a third log in there. Which was an awesome thing. But oh well. We'll be just fine. Painkillers? We don't need no stinking painkillers. We're men. We're men. We heave logs back and forth. We build gigantic towers. That's the kind of man that I am. <laughs> Invented the wheel. Hey, you. Hey, you. Lay down. Why you gotta be mean about it? <laughs> there you go. That's just great. Splinted, splinted, splinted. But my overall body status is now okay. I've been taking uh, good care of myself, and I just yelled at any zombies that might be around. Hey! Zombies! Come and get me! You think you can get me? Bet you can't get me! They totally can. <laughs> Spoilers. They will get the fuck out of me. So, uh, that's a bad button to push. Don't push Q. <laughs> it's not good. I don't like it. But not bad. I I swear I'm walking a little faster. It might be just because I'm not 
uh, heavily exerted. Here comes the exertion. Hello, exertion, my old friend. <laughs> I hate you. Why do you have to show up here? In my moodles. My oodles of moodles. But uh, moodles aren't a good thing to stack up in this game unless they're like well fed. But mine are always like exerted. <laughs> in pain. <laughs> Bleeding. <laughs> is. I like this. I walk by here and I go, is this my home? And it says, is. <laughs> oh. Thank God it was clearly labeled. <laughs> We'll saw some more logs. That's going to be good. It'll get uh, my my weight thingy going. And I'll be like, that's fine. Just hold on to it. Just for one more second. Oh, yeah. One, two, and then three. So I should probably go grab that doctor's bag. I suppose. I suppose it would behoove me. Please no zombies behind me. Please no zombies behind me. Dayton, why don't you just go close the door? Because, okay? It's more exciting this way. Alright? <laughs> there we go. And, uh, we're looking pretty stacked as far as weight goes. Hmm. I could probably leave some, some nails or something, but... I don't know. I like all my stuff. Oh yeah, all these painkillers and fucking wood glue. That's where uh, a lot of it is coming from. Axe, three pounds. Baseball bat, two pounds. That's uh, half of that right there. And you got little stuff like hammers. Oh yeah. It's all normal. <laughs> we'll probably need to chop down another tree, so let's get this ready. I've got so many tools at my disposal. And I am super, super happy that uh, we were able to build the wall in just a day or two. Build the wall! Pink Floyd would be extremely proud, <laughs> I like to think. I could probably uh, go through a house with the sledgehammer, like that apartment building that was down over there, and uh, smash up some doors. I want to smash it up. For the workers who put hours into nothing, I want to smash it up. Yeah, I'm gonna finish chopping all this shit down. Because I can. Because I want to. It feels good. I say, hey nature, fuck you. <laughs> yeah. I'm super exerted now. Too much uh, axe swinging action. Look at all this shit, though. My God. All right, shove as many in there as you can. That's right. What a good boy. How about one more? Just one more. There's a good lad. Now we can finish up the wall. I'll probably need to come back to uh, finish up the door. But yeah, we got a lot of shit over there. I could leash uh, three or four of them together if I were to have some rope. But, uh, yeah, I don't think the zombies are going to touch my logs. There are no other players here to touch my logs. <laughs> I, I, I don't even know why you'd want to touch my log, you know? Just please don't. That's all I'm going to say about that. Please don't. <laughs> For my sake as well as yours. Um, yeah, we got enough for, for three patches, which I think is enough. I think we need four planks to make a door, if I remember correctly. And then, like, two hinges and a doorknob. That makes sense. That would make real good sense to me. This is, uh, looking like shit. My first attempt at making walls is, uh, quite embarrassing. <clears throat> If I'm to be frank. But it's okay. It's not too bad. I just hope the zombies don't come and uh, bang their heads up against it and all that shit. All that shit that they're known to do. We're peckish. We've got high exertion. But I have all the things that I require now. 
So let's make this fucking wall. Build the wall! Yes, build the wall! It's almost complete, gentlemen. Wonderfully done. So proud of you fucking boys. Oh! And it is uh, but a but a little part of the greater the greater plan here, but um, it's definitely a good start. I'll have to go grab some uh, some hinges and things from in here. I think I put them in the trash. Hey, trash! Yeah, just grab one. Boop. Two door hinges. Maybe a little plank. That's nice. That's real nice. All right, so uh, I'm gonna need to get just a few more planks in order to complete the door, but uh, I think that's gonna be worth it. Relatively worth it. Maybe I should stop and uh, get a little more food. Door hinge, doorknob. Got another plank. That'll do fine. We'll make it quick. I'll make it real fast. <laughs> just as fast as it was before. Still got that high exertion, can barely run shit, so hopefully we don't run across too many zombies. But because I've been staying in the same place and just trying to uh, keep it relatively clear, I think uh, I've done a good job. There might be some zombies in these buildings that I don't know are in there, but uh, I don't hear much banging around or anything like that. So it leads me to believe that the neighborhood's kinda safe-ish, Lee, right now. <laughs> Maybe, perhaps. Hmm. I will come back probably with more planks than I need. Technically, I only need one log. Um, but yeah, it's nice to have a little stash of planks as well. I could even make them into wooden crates so they're uh, portable. Well, more portable than they are in plank form. Because a wooden crate uh, has two planks which is six pounds, but when it's in wooden crate form, it's only one pound. So if you're looking to move around some wooden crate, it's a relatively easy way to do that uh, using just just two nails to construct, which is pretty freaking cool. Here's some more logs. Got to take all these. Thanks so much. We're a little bit overweight again, but that's all right. Hopefully I don't uh, pass out. Everything's fine, bro. Just breathe deep. You're gonna be great. We're gonna go craft a door, and then we can have a nice long rest. Well, at least a little cat nap. <laughs> it is only 11 a.m. We've got a lot of shit done today. Mm-hmm. For it being so early, yeah, I'm proud. I can't wait until my fucking leg is fixed, and then we could, like, run and go places. But it seems my sprinting is leveling even with a broken leg, so I guess I'll be grateful for that. Need to get some more skill points. Oh, that's frustrating. My blunt accuracy is pretty high up there now. Maintenance, guard. Guard is really good for uh, avoiding being scratched or bitten if uh, that wasn't inferred. But the uh, only way to get it up is to come close to being scratched or bitten, which I don't like. I don't like that shit. I don't trust it. Look at this bitch. You just hanging out here? You having a good time? Just don't come in here. Don't come in here. We'll be cool. All right, so there's all the shit that I need. Um, let's chop up them logs. Saw all the logs. Mm, 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 mm. And this is mostly the place that I wanted to get enclosed because uh, this is where the generator is. So I know there's going to be some trouble once I turn that fucking thing on. Um, can we make a a thing? I need one more plank, doorknob, door hinge. Okay, now build, mm, wooden sign, wooden fence, I don't understand, I don't understand, how to make, build drawer, no, 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 
No, no, no. Huh. Maybe the door is not made through the, uh, the right-click menu. Maybe it's made in this carpentry menu thing. I do hope. Seems not. Door. Door. Door! God damn it. How to make? Oh, I need a fucking... Another level of carpentry. Damn it. Foiled again. Every time. Ah! Throw all planks, door hinge, doorknob on ground. Extreme fit ensues. <sighs> Going inside the house. I don't give a shit. Nobody talk to me anymore. I'm gonna have a nap over here. Just so I can hear if anybody breaks in. We'll rest for like two hours. That seems fair. And I need to eat still. A little bit of food? A little bit of foodie food? Oh, all these rotten cabbages. What the fuck? I guess I should have prepared them into something. <sighs> That's so frustrating. Here, eat some more eggplants, some grapes, pumpkins. You like all this, don't you? We've got more room in the fridge now, so uh, I could probably go out and collect some things. Ah, but damn. I'm so frustrated. You need one more point in carpentry, Bo! Well, I'm not gonna get it unless I find the intermediate carpentry book. I need to fix my leg before any of this can happen. Don't you see? Don't you see? Just throw a bunch of- bunch more cabbages on the ground. This is normal. Cabbage house. Cabbage patch house is my house. Boop! Dead? Are you dead? Why aren't you dead? Lay down! You're supposed to be dead! Jesus. She doesn't want to go down. I guess my accuracy is just reduced due to some, uh, some myriad factors. They do seem to be walking a little bit faster. A little bit faster, so that's nice. We'll keep it going. What was in this house? This was like a warehouse, I think. Yeah. Furniture warehouse. Did I miss any goodies here? I suppose it's worth a second look. Hmm, this is the office section. I assume this is all junk. Yeah. Vitamins. Vitamins in the office. You guys, wow. That's so healthy. I'm so proud of you. Fertilizer, nails, adhesive tape I could probably use. A few more nails, yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it, I'm here, why not? Head trimmer, packing tape. Hmm. Can I use packing tape to repair things? That could be useful. Some more nails. Hmm. And not much else. New hammer. My hammer's pretty good at the moment. No problem. Box of BBs. Oh, for my Red Rider BB gun. We need to practice our shooting. That's what we need. Another trowel, some nails. Hmm. I don't want nothing in there. Thought there might be a zombie in there because the uh, door was broken in or whatever. Oh my. Tell me about these things. Are they dead? They're stunted. Seedling broccolis. At least it's growing. It did rain just a little bit, so thank Thor, or whoever. <clears throat> kind of tempted to go back in the police station. See if I left any goodies, and I know I did. There's like two lockers that I didn't end up, uh, end up looting. So we just, uh, a little back and forth. Back and forth and back and forth. Oh yeah, get dims. 
Get them shotguns. That's good. Hunting knife, yep. All this can go in the medical bag. <laughs> it serves a medical purpose. Purpose. That's what I said. <laughs> Alright. Load me up, Captain. We can fit a little more. Okay, no we can't. Gotta go now. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. We'll just get it a little bit at a time. I'm uh, living pretty close to this place, you know. But I'll be glad to have some more guns in my bedroom. I really want to use that shotgun and uh, upgrade it just a little bit. It could become quite a nasty thing with the uh, the proper bits and pieces attached to it. And there's the paper trail. Paper trail! <laughs> That's so funny. I crack me up. Jeez. Jeez Louise. Alright, hello home. So good to see you. I do like this as a base. It uh, makes me feel relatively secure. But like I said, might not feel that way once uh, all the zombies start popping up. For now though, I, I'm digging it. I'm digging it a lot. I could live here forever. So uh, let's empty this doctor's bag out onto the floor. Hunting knife, M4 carbine. Um, I think that's it. Box of BBs I'm keeping for now. And that should do. Oh, not enough room on the floor there. How about over here? There you go. That's happy. <laughs> so, friends, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I sincerely hope that you will join us for the next time. Things are starting to heat up, and uh, I'm quite excited to see how this goes. <laughs> I'll be really sad if it all comes to an end, but uh, I hope you'll stick around and find out. If you do remember to like, comment, end, or subscribe, I'll send you a, a laser sight for your pistol. If you don't have a pistol, I'll send you a pistol, whatever. <laughs> Just please, please like, please. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See you, my friends.